It's you. Okay. You're the one who does it. Oh. You're the one who makes me say things about, like, Big Bird and Coca-Cola, and Reaganomics, <laughs> oh, jelly beans. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Carolyn Carney here at Palain Arts, and I'm sitting with the incomparable... <laughs> did, I messed up immediately. Yeah, and in this. And... Hi. I also speak English. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're better. You're, you're more talented than me. <sighs> okay. You should see me doing German. It's better than my Japanese, but worse than just about anything. We probably have, like, German. Here too. I don't know. Oh, there is Japanese. I see it right here. Yeah. Um, it's uh, a more informal introduction, <laughs> but we're going. Are we going or should we, we start again? Uh, let's start again. We'll start again. I think her saying let's start again and us not starting again would be, would be a perfect video. <laughs> <laughs> There's five different languages. <laughs> oh, okay. Are we starting again? We're starting again. Okay. We're starting again. <laughs> should I come in? Only if you sing. <laughs> I would okay. do jazz hands like we like. Oh my god, please do. Oh yeah, you should do that. Right? Yeah, I feel like that works. I think just we should, like we should like just like angry. we should make like a mixtape of this, except Carol's the one who's editing it. She's gonna be like, what is this? And I'm gonna be like, we were punchy and amazing. You're welcome. So, oh my god. Oh, I really want to do that. So I, do it. I mean, I did it. But just the way I sat down, I this. <laughs> Introducing <sighs> N. Oh, hi. Uh, hi. Uh, welcome to our artist talk. Well, thanks for having us. I'm oh, Carolyn Carney, talk. and I'm at Palais Arts yes. with you Me. and... See, that was funny because... Yeah. <laughs> um, we're doing good. <laughs> and we're doing It Is Written, which will be from September 7th through October 29th with a special preview during the Collingswood Fine Arts and Crafts Festival, which is on August 19th and 20th. Would you please introduce us to your piece? Yes, this is a skull, which I have made out of health insurance denials I personally <laughs> received from... It's yeah. a lot of them. It, it's called the specter of care because they send you these very nice notices telling you you don't have any care anymore. Mm -hmm. But they're like skillfully worded. Yeah. So that you can't be, it's, it's not their fault. They're in an, un, an unfortunate yes. situation. They would do it if they could, but they don't want to. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Basically. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and they went to the extra steps of explaining this in 16 different languages. Oh, yeah, so are these all from, like, uh, I know you lived in Japan for a long time. Mm. Uh, so are these American notices or Japanese notices, a mix of both? These are all in America. Oh, least. yeah, and then on the back, you, they almost always have it in all the different languages. Yes, so like you yeah. get to he see, like, how they rejected you in German and Spanish and Japanese and, I believe, Korean. Mm -hmm. uh, there's probably, there's, like, 15 different languages, which... Uh, is good because, you know, there's a lot of different ways to say, no, we don't want to, yes. and they make sure they hit them off. And, like, the graphic styles of all the scripts in these languages, I, I thought was very compelling. Yeah. Although the message is uniformly terrible. Yeah. I also threw in some little bits of, like, cookie-cutter statements in their fortune cookies, like, yeah. little bits of, like, shallow advice. Well, and it's nice because one of the things that's interesting, uh, first of all, I love that you use, like, found objects and found materials in your pieces to kind of tell the story. Mm -hmm. But also, this has a motion to it, the way it moves and tells a story, so that it is a skull, it is a specter, yeah. but also there's something about a specter that it's not just a skeleton, because a skeleton is just bones. This has a life to it, and you're still alive while they're telling you how you're going to die in these letters. Like, <laughs> yes. So there's something so perfect about this, like, specter of the care that you're not getting and the specter of the ghost that you could be because you're being denied care. That's a very nice uh, syllogy, I think. I always enjoy how insightful you are in these. Yeah. 
I like, yeah, I like this little piece of uh, dripping tongue drool, which is perfect. That's from the windows on those envelopes. Oh my god, that's even better. Did yeah. you, so did you melt this with a hair dryer? Uh, no. What did it's I do? really, it's, it's really, it's nice and firm. I, I did it through some, like, a really wet adhesive, and then there's, oh, yeah. sort of, like, a UV uh, glossy coating, too. So I love it. So in the mouth it says, eat your own, and then it says, eat your own in this eye, and eat, I just, eat, uh, eat it. <laughs> yeah, so uh, it's so perfect. Um, so, what made you think, hey, I got all these rejections and I'm going to make it this? Oh, I just, like, I wondered, like, what it would be like to read and understand each different language. Yeah. Because they all have the same, like, contents to them, but they look so different. Well, and there's something to, like, in this show is obviously called It Is Written, and so we're talking about different ways that language is used and. Um, the mythos and the story and the anecdotes of it, but there's also something so interesting about it that they're being so accommodating by putting it in all these different languages. At the same time, they're being super yeah. not accommodating by telling you like, uh, too bad, uh, either pay for it or too bad. So, um, I am still alive at this point. Yeah, so it worked out for you. So yeah. in spite of the spect, it, be- <laughs> it was just a specter because if not, I'm just be a skeleton, um, be a corpse. Then you would call a corpse of care if you were like, that's not funny, that's sad. So, but, uh, but I love this piece. Um, your other piece is interesting too, and we'll pop up a little visual of that here. Um, it's called, oh, if you want to grab it. You can. Oh, sure. Excuse me. <laughs> You're going to have to lift it pretty high. Yeah, like. Like maybe even higher than that. Mm-hmm. I think more. up more. Sadie's, Sadie's guiding us. Yes. What's good we got her there? Yeah. Sadie, thank you. She's wearing nice shoes. She is. You'll see it in another video. <laughs> so it's called The Drowners. And oh, what is it called? Is that not it? We have, I have one called The Drowners. <laughs> I'm pretty, oh, The Deaths. The, the, deaths. the yes. Drowners is the one where there's cats and the, yeah. the what's called the coppers. And the coppers. So, true. yeah. So The Deaths. What I like about this is, if you've seen other work of um, and he uses a lot of materials and like letters and papers that were sent to him or guidebooks, uh, but he usually makes them three-dimensional. And this is a, like you do other work like this, but this one is the first one that we're showing that shows his painting work, like his true mixed media and like layers the two-dimensional in the way that we're used to seeing three-dimensional. So I like how these two things go together which I think is really cool. I made almost 90% of this while I was at work. <laughs> and it's like mostly old documents I, I got out of the recycling bin. I'm work. really curious, wait, what were you doing at the time? I worked at a Chinese auction house and the owners would only come in on Friday. That sounds like a great job and a great use of your time. Right. Um, now he's a paramedic, uh, so. Just an EMT. Just, well, an EMT, but it's still a very important job. Mm. Uh, I bet you don't have time to do this while you're Oh, Lord, no. Imagine no. that. Yeah, that was, I don't think anybody would seek that out in a EMT. <laughs> They'd be like, hold on, I have to finish my, my collage. Uh, Let's just sorry, Mr. Smith. Uh, I couldn't make it. I ran out of epoxy, and that took me a long time. So, so Ends work will be here till October 29th. We hope that you all come see it. Uh, it's always delightful to talk oh, to you. Uh, I think we always we always uh, enjoy like finding new things in our talks. So mm. yeah. So thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs>